At Burlington, I was a cashier and also a sales representative. Basically, my job was to finalize the customer's transaction at the register, um, being accurate with cash, and when the job as a sales associate basically is to walk around the store and make sure that you know the department and you can assist the customers in finding merchandise. The work environment, um, it's a fast pace. Um, we were in a, a, a big mall, opposed to just a department store. So a lot of traffic, like I said, um, fast pace, and yeah. Well, as a sales associate, what you would do, obviously you go in and you clock in. Um, after you clock in, what you do is you report to whoever that department um, supervisor may be. Um, when you go to them, they'll let you know what plans they have for the day for you, whether you come in the morning or you'll probably be a part of the closing shift. Um, and basically, they just you go report to your supervisor and they'll let you know what plans they have for you. At that time, I'm sure now that they're online, but I had a paper application. Um, I kept in contact with the supervisor. It actually took probably about um, two weeks altogether. Once I turned in my application and had an interview, um, I was hired a week after that. The interview was basic behavioral questions, um, and it was simple. I was very comfortable. They make sure you're comfortable. So. Behavioral questions such as name a time when you had to assist someone or name a time when you went out of your way to assist someone or even um, tell us how you dealt with a unruly customer or even an unruly coworker. Well, at Burlington Co Factory, it is um, casual, if you will, as far as in the workers. So when you go, you would probably just want to wear a nice polo and some slacks, not necessarily a suit and tie, but again, there's nothing wrong with that. So. Good customer service skills and understanding what customer service is. Let us set you apart. I had a phone call um, from the hiring manager, and it, it took a week, about a week. Um, basically, just make sure when it comes to your interview, just that you're energetic. You want to be energetic. They want to know that um, you're personable when it comes to working with customers and also with their staff. So that's what I would say. Just make sure you're personable and energetic.